Okay, boys and girls, you all know that if you need images, it's not like the old days, you don't go and clip something out of a magazine, you go to Google Images and you steal it. And when we say that you steal it, you actually literally are stealing it. So let's say that I look, and I've just punched the microphone, sorry about that, you'll all cope. So I'm looking for an image of a black dog. Whoops, I forgot to go to images. There we go. So there's all these fantastic images of black dogs, and who doesn't love a black dog while I'm at it? The problem with this is that other people own them. They didn't give these images to Google. Google just shows them to you, and Google doesn't say, please steal this image. But we are so used to stealing these images, we think this is why it's offered to us. There is good news, however, and by the way, if you want to stop the video and argue amongst yourselves about whether you think copyright law applies to you, I'll give you a hint. It does. And, oh, I'll never get caught for it. Great. Fine. Do the wrong thing, but not in this class. You're not going to. So, don't you agree, Mrs Walsh? Yeah, she's nodding very vigorously at this point. Um, so, help is at hand. We click on search tools here, usage rights. Labelled for reuse. These are people who put up their images and say, you know what, I'm fine with you reusing these images. So these ones here, you can actually grab these images, but you've got to make sure they are labelled for reuse. So look at that dog, it's just seven types of adorable. Now, don't grab the image from here because you'll find it pixelated and grotty and it's not cool. Go to view image. There we go. Good dog. Good dog. Good dog. Grab him from there when he's nice and high definition. And now we're going to go and pop him in a PowerPoint presentation. Because what you're doing in this session is you're starting me a PowerPoint presentation and you're giving me 10 images that relate to you. This is a bit like the mind map we did earlier in the term. So I'm making it nice and small so that I can see that. Now see how the dog's sitting in the middle? I don't want him sitting in the middle. So I grab it by the corner, not by the edge because that'll distort it, but by the corner. And then I'm going to put him over my page. And if I look up here, I see that cute looking black dog. I okay, F5 him. Man, that's a handsome looking beast. I think you'd agree. And I'm not breaking the law. And I'm going to do 10 of those. And I'm going to put it in in Edmodo. And I'm going to be a good student. Mr. O'Hara is going to be a happy man. This is very quick. Don't you think, Mrs. Walsh? Yeah, yeah, I was thinking that too. Um, so... Um, so that's, this is due. You're going to need to race through this, get it put in today. Good work.